Hi guys, I have to make this fast because this little genius um, did not study for her philosophy and chemistry tests. Smart. And I have them tomorrow. Okay, so this week we're doing questions and I have to find the questions. Um, we're doing questions and here we go. Um, if I were an animal, what would I want to be and why? I would probably want to be a cat because I love them and they are very sort of, I don't know, I just love cats. They're so cute. And plus they get to sleep and do nothing all day. Um, what really bugs you? Um, I think it would be, one of the things which really bugs me is when people make loads and loads of noise when they eat. Um, what do you eat on a typical day? You know, snacks, meals, kind of food, etc. So I guess since I'm, you know, at school, it'll be bread. Because I eat sandwiches and stuff. Um, bread and probably like meat, maybe. Mainly carbohydrates. Mm. And some chocolate. <laughs> um, what is your dream job? Um, and if everything works out, where do you see yourself in five years? So technically, I guess my dream job would sort of to be um, a surgeon. Because I get to help people. Um, and in five years time, I just realized that in five years time, I'm still going to be studying because I'm going to be 21, I'll be at university and I'm, I'm going to be studying. Um, but hopefully I'll have a nice car. <laughs> um, a car and like a flat and a cat. And then my life will be complete. Um, yes, flat, car, cat, that's all it takes to make me happy. Amazing. Um, what strange conversations or awkward moments have you had in elevators? Now, I don't really use elevators or lifts, whatever you want to call them. don't use them that much, um, so I haven't really had any awkward moments or strange conversations. So I'm going to talk about like a little strange thing which happened in the bathroom at McDonald's. We were three girls in the girls' bathroom, and one, two cubicles, one was occupied, and you know, after quite some time, we're like, okay, this person is still in here, maybe they fainted, you know, like, are they okay? And as soon as we said that, this guy walks out, and I was like, you know, we just stood there and stared at him like, what? You know, um, yeah, and I, I immediately sort of ran into the cubicle he was in just to see, like, what the heck was going on. You know, I was looking for some other girl or something, I don't know. Um, I guess it was more awkward for him than it was for us. It was kind of weird. What is your biggest fear? Oh, hmm. Right, so. <laughs> I don't like spiders. So my biggest fear would probably have to be being covered in spiders with no way out. That and someone getting into loads and loads and loads and loads of trouble, or like dying because of something I did. Um, number eight. If you could have a superpower, what would it be and why? Um, I would want to be able to fly because there's just something about flying like you can go anywhere you want and it can just like fly you know in the sky and just think like, yeah and it's very eco-friendly I think I guess so yeah. what is one of the most awkward or embarrassing moments that happened to you I can't think of a proper like moment but I always get kind of embarrassed um, when for example I'm in a shop and I'm, buy I'm going to buy something and I realize that like I don't, know, I don't have money or I forgot something or you know that kind of stuff I get embarrassed when things like that happen to me someone is calling me, it's my mummy Alma Hi, I'm Dark, I'm going to I'm going to go to the house I'm going to go to the house I'm going to go to the house all right, okay. All right, ciao, ciao. See, you heard me speak in Maltese. Yeah. Okay, I think that's it now. Bye.